Hey all, Kurt Sasser here from TGT Media, of course, at Fan Expo Canada 2013. We're joined today by the very talented Lamin Martin. Uh, once again, we, it's been a while. How are you doing today? I'm um, very good. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you too. It's been far too long since we last talked here. You know, what, what brings you back to Fan Expo? Well, I have a new book that's uh, coming out, so I debuted at Fan Expo. And it's uh, a book, a uh, collection of all of my illustration work, uh, most of my color work, some pencil, along with tutorials on some of how, to, of, on how some of the color images were made. Well, that's that's amazing because I mean I, I look at your style and I, I I stare in awe because you know you have so much detail, so many vibrant colors and subtle tones going back and forth between the images that it, it's got to take you like hundreds of thousands of hours just to get some of these done. Uh, yeah, it does take a lot of time. Like uh, I had to actually dedicate six months to a year just to learn Photoshop because I, I usually just draw uh, in pencil and um, I didn't really get into using color too much. But after a while, like it's hard to just sell black and white sketches all the time so um, yeah I just took the time I learned a lot from YouTube I learned from a friend of mine who showed me a few of the basics like the brushes I needed to know and the layer layering I needed to um, uh, keep in mind and then from that point it was just YouTube yeah see technology is helping out it's amazing yeah. uh, everyone usually has that one person that kind of inspired them down their path to where they are now who is that for you um, in terms of illustrators you mean uh, I'd say, well, I like a lot of British illustrators, so I like Brian Froud a lot, I like Arthur Rackham, uh, Adam Lee is really good, uh, those are probably my major influences, and um, uh, I don't know, I, I just draw a lot of inspiration from them, I don't know. <laughs> That's good. Yeah. Do you consider yourself successful? Oh, absolutely, yes. Yeah. Uh, I work full-time at a game studio doing concept art, which is what I wanted to do, and then I can do... Um, the stuff that I love in terms of ideas uh, on my own time, which is all of the illustration work that I have here at Fan Expo, along with the book. Yeah. That's cool. Then uh, how do you deal with your failures? Uh, I learn from them. Yeah, that's the best thing to do. So I don't consider them failures. I consider them uh, unexperienced attempts. Yeah. That's the second time I've heard that today, actually. So it, it must be a common thing. That's yeah. wonderful. Um, you know, a lot of people are coming through, they're looking at their work, they're buying your stuff, which is great, and they're drawing inspiration from it. Yeah. Uh, you know, what personal experience, sorry, wrong question, that's the afterwards. Uh, how can these, how can the younger generation inspire themselves in, for the future? Inspire themselves for the future? That's a, <laughs> I don't know how to really answer that one. Um, the, I'd say, they really have to find something that they love to do and do it all the time, absolutely. Like, don't treat it as a hobby. Uh, don't treat it as something you'll just put off and then pick up a little bit later. Like, if the urge hits to do it, do it then and do it now. And then everything else will happen, will roll as a result of that. Just don't procrastinate. Yes, do not procrastinate. No, not at all. <laughs> The final question then is, uh, what personal experiences are you going to take away from this convention once it's all up and done and you head back home? Uh, it's the usual, like it's just meeting everybody. I haven't seen a lot of these people in over a year or so. So it's just reconnecting with old friends and, and learning what they've learned over the year and seeing what they're doing and, and uh, applying it and moving forward so that the, the following year we're just bigger and better than last time. Well, hey, women, I'll let you get back to it. you got a lot of people looking at your stuff. Thanks so much for taking yeah. the time to do this. I really Absolutely. appreciate it. Thanks a lot. Oh, when can, where can we find your stuff as well? Oh, you can find my work at laminmartin.com, where you can pick up the new book, which is called Perennials. And we are watching TGT.